video, I am finally getting down to doing this, the corset and waist training video. I'm not an expert. I've only gotten into this about two months ago. I started doing my research and then I finally gave in to buy an A seal boned corset. I'm just going to give you guys an overview. I will be showing you guys how exactly I tie my corset. So I'm going to show you guys all that on screen. <laughs> the first thing is, what is waist or corset training? They're pretty much, the terms are synonymous. Waist or corset training is when you have an objective in mind. So this is not a regular corset that you wear, uh, I guess, I don't know, for a Halloween costume. Corset or waist training entails that you wear a specific corset for a long period of time for moderate to high reductions of your waist. So you're gonna see reduction in inches and you are gonna alter your muscles and rib cage. Of course, yeah. you're gonna wanna implement diet and exercise to see any kind of really big change, but if you don't implement diet or exercise, you might see changes, but they're not going to be as drastic as someone that's exercising and eating really healthy and wearing their corset for a longer period of time. You're going to be more effective at molding your body if you're wearing the correct corset. This now, is the one that I have. It's kind of, now it's open in the back, but it comes tied. Um, that's because I've been using this for a while. It kind of looks a little messy. Maybe I should kind of fix this. This is a steel boned corset. I will put all the specifications of this corset down below in the description box. So when you first get it, it's going to be really tightly placed in the back. So what you're going to want to do is just kind of loosen up all these strings. Then it has this extra material here to cover. I almost forgot to mention one of the most important things. You're going to want to wear a corset that's four to six inches smaller than your natural waist. I'm going to measure my waist it's going to be about an inch above your belly button and it is about a 30 uh, a little bit over here i got a corset that's 26 inches so this bow that comes on top it's going to be it's going to go on top yeah that's right it's easier to clip at the bottom so you're going to want to clip at the bottom and then start clipping in now i'm going to turn around making sure that the lace is covered so it doesn't bother your skin. All right, now I have these two strings here. I'm gonna start pulling them. Okay, you don't have to go as tight as I'm going. And now I'm gonna tie it in the back. All right, so I did tie that once and as you see, there's a lot of string left what I like to do is wrap it around and then I wrap it around again. I finish off by tying it in the front so that it's still comfortable so that you could wear at work. This is yeah. about 28 inches. This is how small it looks. There are various types of corsets that can be purchased for waist training. The one that I have on is the full steel boned corset underbust underbust waist cincher so it's not full there's a lot of there's tons of them that come up to and cover your breast and actually they're longer in length which is probably the next one that I want to try out because this one you still do see I guess a little bit of this fat over here even if I pull down my shirt like my waist looks so small I love it and my stomach looks so flat yeah, and it also boosts up your bosoms, your ladies. Yeah. So that's it for this video, and I hope you guys got some more insight on what waist or corset training is. Just the beginning of my journey. I do plan on continuing this for a very long time. Even if you don't see a huge reduction in your waist, it's always good because it helps with your posture. Eating with this thing on is not the easiest thing, and I find myself getting a lot fuller quicker. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys are going to be trying this out. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.